It's time now to head back to the set of the new Boyzone video to hear how the lads are getting on with each other and how they're doing without their brother Stephen. With six number one singles, five number one albums, and more than 20 million records sold, Boyzone continued to enjoy success. So I decided to speak to each of the lads about making the transition from boy band to man band. We're a bit older now, you know. It's 17 years since we shot a video. Well, it's not really. It's 17 years since we shot the first video. Yeah. So um, starting to get the hang of it now. But come here, you have your own little solo bit there. Congrats. It sounds I know. good. Well, I said for years that we were keeping my voice back as a little kind of, uh, you know, backup plan should we ever need it and, uh, and obviously now they're, they're asking me to bring it out there so I decided I would and I sound great don't I? You do, you sound good, <laughs> I'm, I'm glad we waited this length of time to hear no, you I'm Keith. delighted, I have to say, I'm delighted to make it onto one of our singles, it's brilliant. You're on fire out there. You're really loving it. I love it. It's great. I mean, the energy between the four of us is, well, always with the five of us was very special. But, you know, we're trying to put one foot in front of the other now and start as a new band today. It's a big day for us, really, you know, because obviously we went through all of the different stuff, you know, the tribute for Steo and all those different things at the start of the year that we had to do for closure, I guess, in a way. And now we need to move on as this new boy zone. And, and today is about that and about, you know, enjoying each other's company and giving it all we can for the new single because it's the start of something hopefully brilliant for us all. Mikey, you're smiling away out there. You're really enjoying yourself. Yeah, having a good day out there today. I mean, it's bloody freezing, but uh, as well as that, I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> so, uh, you know, just once you smile, you get away with more. Uh, come here, I was one. liking you uh, taking off Shane. Oh, did you like nice little do butterfly. A little bit, a little bit, bit of Christy Dignam. I don't know what the hell he's at these days. I don't know, I don't know where he's going. He's got mad he is all together. It's a good look, though. I think so, yeah. Well, yeah. We'll see how it goes anyway. It's working for him at the moment. <laughs> Shannon, I'm loving the dance. What's going on? Well, you know, you have to kind of uh, express yourself in many, many ways. And one of my ways is through tattooing and dance. Yeah. And that's what happens when I get when I get on stage, that's what happens. You know? I'm liking it. It's a new look for you. You know, I think for years and years, I was afraid to step out of the box. Uh, really? I wouldn't agree with you there, Shane. If anything, you've stepped back into the box. Is what? This, yeah. Ah, no, no, no. What you're seeing, what you're actually seeing is on the real side of life, the normal side of life, the everyday drive the kids to school kind of life, yeah, I'll be way more quieter. But when it comes to stage, I'll be quite more advanced in my expression. But what I really want to know is if the rumours are true about him kind of getting naked for one of the scenes of the video. You know what? I wasn't kind of naked at all. You were completely I was naked. Completely, 100% naked. The whole concept, again, of that initial scene is um, when you're first enter this world you're naked so that's what I am I'm standing on the side of the, or the edge of a pool I fall into it and I come back out of the water and um, but yeah you get the full profile of the full kind of rear end stroke not quite front end I tucked it away somewhere but nonetheless yeah I'm naked <laughs> naked or not we're sure love is a hurricane will be a massive success